After the coronavirus cut short an excellent season last year, the Great Falls Americans came into this season feeling like they had unfinished business, and they'll get their chance next week when the playoffs start. The Americans were on a roll in the NA3HL divisional playoffs last year before the premature cutoff, and the players have been itching to get back to the postseason. Very eager. Um, all the returning squad from last year that's all we've been looking for for the whole year, so especially with it getting cut off short last year, that was really hard. So coming in this year helps a lot, and with that coming up, brings a lot of joy around everybody. Much like 2020, the Americans once again finished the regular season playing stellar hockey, winning nine of their last ten and finishing second in the Frontier Division standings. COVID created some hurdles earlier in the year, but the team feels much better about a playoff run these days. Things are starting to loosen up around here, and we get to play every day. It's just kind of, you know, it's it, it's made the mood so good around here that, you know, we're just kind of excited to, to be at this point. Um, I would have never guessed we would have got 40 games in, so, um, you know, it's kind of a victory for everybody. In the upcoming best of three first round, they'll face the three-seeded Gillette Wild out of Wyoming, a team they're more than familiar with. We're going to have to be physical, um, you know, and use our speed. It will be all right if we, we stay out of the penalty box, and, uh, you know, it's going to be a, a good series. We're pretty much playing ourselves. It's two, two similar styles, and, uh, you know, there's a lot of travel involved, so it's, it's going uh, to be an interesting week. Game one will be on Thursday in Gillette, while game two and the if necessary game three will be in Great Falls. Reporting in Great Falls, Isaiah Dunk, MTN Sports.